This is me in all my glory. <laughs> this is actually what I do to get my um, heatless curls. And I also have a little bit of dry shampoo up here because it's actually better to sleep with it when you know you're gonna have greasy hair in the morning because it will give it time to absorb. So, yeah. Don't know why I decided to show you that, but I'm thinking about vlogging tomorrow, so I'll show you the curls then. Good morning. So, I'm in a hurry this morning, but I wanted to show you what my hair looks like after sleeping in it all night. I woke up a little late because I could not sleep at all last night. I was having so much anxiety, and I have no idea why. I've gotten better about that since being on my anxiety medication, but... Last night was different. So, yeah, I just pull, uh, <laughs> just pull my hair up like that. And then, of course, these will fall into more waves by this afternoon. And then with the dry shampoo, just flip my head over and shape. It's like perfectly done hair, or at least perfectly how I like it done. So yeah, super easy if you've never seen that before, which I'm sure you have, but it's just, it's incredible to me because, you know, God, <laughs> it's incredible to me because in um, high school, I was like waking up at like 6 a.m. curling my hair every day for school because I was one of those people. Katniss. Now I don't have to touch it with a curling iron. So I just did this, not as a fashion statement, but because I'm doing my makeup. And today I'm going with my mom. Yeah, and we are going to do just some Christmas shopping, just get out of the house. Um, Katniss has already had her morning snack, but she's feeling a little vocal today. So, oh, I said that now she's like rubbing against me like, oh yeah, you understand. this really cute outfit plan that I'm excited to show you but oh yeah we're going probably to see a movie and then to do some more shopping I think both of us are actually already done with our Christmas list but my mom is one of those people where she likes to overbuy in case she didn't buy enough for somebody on accident because she does have five children and so she always wants us to be like even in our presence and feel like we had enough. I have to go to the post office and mail a letter because I don't have a stamp and then I have to go to my mom and dad's house and pick up my mom and then we'll be headed on our way. So yeah, looking a little crazy right now, but hopefully when I come back to you, I'll be looking a little better. So this is what I'm thinking for my outfit. I'm going to put, this is like a summer dress that I have. I'm going to put a bra over this and then tuck the sweater in. I saw this on TikTok and you just like literally can tuck the sweater up into it and it makes this such a cute little outfit and look like it's supposed to, you know, be together. And then I'm also going to be wearing these since it is freezing outside. So basically, if you want the, um, the look of like a sheer tight, you just put your skin color legging underneath it and then it still looks sheer, but you're warm. These are like the fluffiest, coziest things. And yeah, I'm just going to wear both of those. So I'll show you what I mean by the tuck, but that's my outfit for today. So it would look like that. This little frumpy thing if I let it go. But 
since I have the bra. I don't know why I keep flashing it. It's just so weird. I'll just tuck it up underneath here. Have a little bit of floof. Also, if you didn't know, doing this to your leggings where you like scrunch it up where your hand is all the way to the bottom makes it so much easier to put on. So these are the toes. You have a scrunch up like this. And then let me see if I can show you this. So you just put it on your foot and then it just goes straight up and it makes it so much easier to put on. Oh, and then I'm gonna go grab a dryer sheet because with tights, your outfit always like sticks to them. And um, a dryer sheet, run that under the bottom of it, works like a charm. I also forgot to say that what I was wearing that day was a dossier fragrance as well because I think that that is the ultimate pick me up finding a fragrance that you love. Dossier has so many and really they are inspired by the most expensive luxury brands to create fragrances that you love that you know for a fraction of the price and so that is why I love to use them. I am someone who will always take a good deal and you aren't really sacrificing the smell of these perfumes when you go with Dossier. So if you want to try it you can use the code Dossier10 to get 10% off and thank you to Dossier for sponsoring this portion of the video. Now let's go back to the to the vlog. Let's go back. I also added this little necklace. I got this guy from Target. And I'm gonna see if I can give you a full body shot. <laughs> that sounds horrible. Um, set you here. Maybe you're a little slanted. Yeah, it looks like the whole room is falling. <laughs> Not there. Let's see, what if I stick you in my tree? Will that work? I put the little strap on a branch like it's an ornament. Nope, not gonna work. It's gonna fall. Hmm. Here. Possibly. Nope, too high. You still can't see. <laughs> okay, maybe this is a failure. It's officially that time of year when I should have started my car earlier because there's ice on the windshield. I was gonna vlog in there, but it was just too insane. So I got a few things at Target. I got batteries for my car remote so exciting <laughs> and then I got these which I've never seen before they are skittle gummies and they're actually like in the shape of little skittles but they're gummies I'm so excited and then I found this book I was in there because my sister was she met us here and she wanted to give me a book for Christmas and she couldn't find what she liked I found another one for her to get but I found this one and that's from uh, Reese Witherspoon's book club and it's called Fire Keeper's Daughter I think keep the secret live the lie earn your truth it sounds really good it's also beautiful so excited to read this now I think we're gonna go get um, Chick-fil-a milk no oh yes I forgot about we have from being like um, what is it being on the app yeah, I think so. We got this uh, Chick-fil-A gift card for a peppermint milkshake, and they have the best milkshakes, so. Does it have a date? Do we pass the date? Offer expires, no, the <gasps> 31st of <gasps> December. Right. Let's go. Oh, oh, I'm stuck. Oh my, oh, I forgot it was inside my coat. <laughs> <laughs> There's too many people, too many cars. Not enough milkshakes. Okay. 
Okay, so I almost didn't add this clip in because of just the way my stomach looked, but then I thought about that and was like, you know what? I would have never say that to anybody else. Think that all bodies are beautiful, so I'm gonna keep this in. <sighs> okay, we're back from TJ Maxx. Put y'all on some socks. So we tried on things in the dressing room and I decided I no longer wanted to wear my tights. They were cutting off circulation and so I stuffed them in my bag. They couldn't all fit in my tiny bag so I was giving some to my mom. She starts freaking out telling me that it, it looks bad, it looks bad. So then the whole rest of the time I was worried we were going to get arrested for stealing my own tights. <sighs> and so then I realized once I took off my tights I don't have any socks on. So I walked out in my boots with no socks, so my mom bought me some socks. We are going to watch Spider-Man. So I'm back home now, all cuddled up on the couch because it's freezing outside. But I wanted to give you an update on the movie, the new Spider-Man No Way Home, I think is what it's called. So I liked it. I definitely liked the second one. No spoilers, by the way. I definitely liked the second one better um, with Tom Holland, obviously. This one was very sad though, and I was not expecting that. <laughs> sad in a lot of different ways, I think. All in all, it was a good movie. It's just not exactly what I expected, but that's okay. I will tell you a secret though. I have never watched the other two Spider-Mans, and you should let me know which one is the best if you have, and if I should watch them. And tomorrow, I think I'm gonna go back to my parents' house, and we're going to do some Christmassy things. So I might bring you along then. Good morning, it's the next day. I'm getting ready for uh, my Christmas day with my family. We're just, you know, staying home and doing kind of some Christmassy things. We might go and look at the lights. And so I'm just kind of wearing this like comfy set to go there because they literally don't care what I look like. And I am a little tired today because I actually stayed up all night reading this book. I've been reading it for a while and I'm like literally almost done with it. So I'm taking it with me today in case I have any free time. But False Hearts, oh my God. If you are into any sort of dystopian world, if you're into cults, murder, Basically, if you watch my other channel, <laughs> you will probably like that book. It is so good. And I just felt like, you know, I should um, do something to like calm my mind when I got home yesterday. Because when I do very social things, even though it doesn't seem very social just to go shopping and stuff. For me, like after the pandemic, my social battery is so low that that is just far too much for me. So... I came home and I didn't just want to go on YouTube and like watch stuff and I wanted to actually you know calm my mind and hoped that that would help with sleeping because you guys know the night before I didn't sleep very well and it, it really did help as soon as I was done with that I pretty much fell right to sleep so I don't know if that's why or if I was just exhausted but it was nice just to stay up reading and it was kind of like when I was a kid and my mom was like you need to go to bed and I'm like but I need to finish this book you know I couldn't finish it but um, I did read a lot of chapters so I also these are the shoes I'm putting on and I have been loving them I got them from ASOS it's like their own brand of tennis shoes but they're just like that chunky like dad like shoe super good to put with just like sweatsuits like this or you can pair it with anything you want really and i love wearing them they're so comfortable they're just all white so yeah we'll see if i film anything there um and if not i will see you tonight 